Hello, my name is Jonah Gelzo, Audio Tuts Plus and AE Tuts Plus author. I'm pleased to present my review of the JAG 35's Austin DSLR rig. Okay, um, my girlfriend asked me to wear this shirt. Here it is, I'm gonna take it off now. <laughs> I first found out about JAG35 and the product lineup via the online filmmaker resource, nofilmschool.com. What I really like about JAG35 is that just like myself, the Garcia brothers, Jehu and Misa Garcia at JAG35 are extremely passionate about film. The Garcia's company, JAG35, really was a spinoff of their passion for the medium. Just like so many of us, the Garcia's passion for creating movies afforded them all the drive, but none of the expensive equipment. Instead, the brothers began researching how to mimic the look of film with standard HD camcorders. Utilizing 35mm adapters, they fabricated themselves. Before too long, others wanted in on their affordable creations, and after a few custom bills for friends, their side hobby turned into a full-fledged growing company, now offering a wide range of original products designed and built by JAG35. Coming from someone who desired high quality, just not the high price tag, JAG35 really aims to meet the need of aspiring filmmakers everywhere through well thought out products that not only meet our expectations, but meet it while staying under budget. And staying under budget is key when you're fueling your filmmaking dreams by serving a good old cup of joe, working as a barista at your neighborhood coffee shop. JAG35 offers a variety of products such as DSLR rigs, moddable and interchangeable components, as well as affordable electronic remote follow focus kits, motorized and non-motorized DSLR sliders, and more. Typically, a lot of Gear Envy is reserved for Zacuto camera accessories, and no doubt they produce exceptional products. However, the exceptional part of that sentence is also reflected in the purchase price. If you're serious about filmmaking and have some extra cash, then any Zacuto product really is a worthwhile investment, as it'll last and hold up to the rigors of shooting being fabricated in the USA at the highest of standards. But if you're looking to retain high quality but cut the strain on your wallet, then JAG35 products are the next best thing. That might sound like a negative remark, but it's really a great thing. When you pick up a JAG35 product, you don't feel like a second-rate wannabe like you do when you pick up that affordable DSLR rig or accessory online that was made in China out of cheap, breakable plastic. With JAG35, you feel like you just made out like a bandit and that feeling won't get you put in jail. After communicating with Jehu about my upcoming film shoot overseas in Japan and stressing the need for a highly portable yet rugged moddable rig at a price I could stomach, he directed me to one of their newest JAG35 editions, the Austin Rig. JAG35 designed the Austin Rig version 2 to be highly mobile and easy to travel with. They really tried to design the Austin rig so it afforded the filmmaker a lot of shooting options while really trying to keep the size and overall footprint of the rig to a minimum. The rig is also priced right in the middle above their more entry level rigs, yet more cost effective than the highest priced and most feature rich full shoulder rig. The Austin rig is categorized as an offset rig, so instead of needing an external monitoring option with the straight rig, the offset rig literally offsets the camera position so that it comfortably places the camera directly in line of sight of the operator, allowing the operator to use the built-in camera LCD monitor. The rig also utilizes an offset raised rail block version 2, which vertically raises the height of the camera, so again it lines up better to the operator's eye. It also sports a comfortable shoulder pad for that third point of contact, which dramatically increases shooting stability, as well as counterweight to relieve a lot of the forearm fatigue that occurs when your forearms are tasked with holding up a front heavy camera setup. The Austin rig only comes with one hand grip, which cuts down on the rig size and is designed to allow the operator to further stabilize the rig by maintaining the other hand on the camera's focus and zoom controls. For most shooting situations, you as a shooter have to maintain zoom and focus controls yourself, so doing without the second hand grip is a no-brainer and allows your setup to be more portable and mobile. And when you're on our crew in Japan, the more mobile and user-friendly the gear is, the more likely you're going to use it all the time. 
And in Japan, the Austin rig hardly left my side. Me and the rest of our crew really began to prefer shooting with the Austin rig over much more expensive rigs we've used in the past. I really liked how comfortable and adjustable the rig is via single knob tightening controls, which allow me to adjust the various components along the rails fast and efficiently to get that perfect fit. Everything feels really solid, tight and well put together, and I really love how small and portable it really is. And that made a huge difference when shooting in cramped and crowded shooting locations in Tokyo. I also really like that the Austin rig doesn't feel cumbersome after a long day of shooting, like a lot of other heavier and larger rigs out there. When you're traveling, living, and shooting out of your backpack, you really learn to bring only the essentials, the things that you need most, while leaving anything else that'll slow you down behind. And with the Austin rig, it's light enough to carry around all day and is super easy to break down and store on the outside of the backpack or even inside it. Having shot and utilized the rig every day overseas for two weeks, I can only highly recommend the rig as another perfect fit for my wallet, but most importantly, as a great asset for filmmakers on the go. The increased ability of panning, tilting, and tracking talent with the rig makes a huge difference, and with the modifiability of the rig, allows the rig to evolve as your shooting style needs through additional JAG-35 components or other third-party manufacturers as JAG-35 rigs utilize industry standard 15mm rails. You can also custom build your own rigs for separately buying components, but the best way to save money through JAG-35 is picking up an already set up rig that best matches your current needs in the field. For me, the Austin rig was the best match for what I needed, and I further customized my rig setup by switching out the standard camera stand to the JAG-35 quick release gorilla stand which allows me to interface with Zacuto Z Finder Pro and Gorilla Quick Release Plate. This add-on was essential as I would often have to quickly change from running with the full rig setup with follow focus for stability and shot accuracy to being able to rapidly detach the camera completely from the rig and shoot completely handheld when needed. With the Gorilla Stand, I can just pop it back on the rig and not have to worry about readjusting the follow focus. I also picked up the tripod plate basic, which can be added onto the bottom of the Gorilla quick release stand component, which allows me to attach the full rig to a tripod. When I have my camera rigged out with follow focus, de-zoom, and matte box, I also like that with the single knob controls on the jag 35s rigs, I could easily untwist the tightening knob on the offset raised rail block and slide out the rails easily and attach a lighter weight and even smaller shooting setup for tripod shots or simply when wanting to quickly shoot handheld while retaining all my add-ons. I also like to pick up a few extra varied rail lengths so I can utilize shorter rails when keeping my setup as small and simplistic as possible or insert longer rails when needing more room for sliding on a full matte box and follow focus and zoom controls. The Austin rig really aided in helping me get some really great and interesting looking shots all over Japan and quickly became a hot commodity on location as the other crew constantly asked to shoot with the rig. The JAG-35 really became a personal favorite piece of gear for me and really gets props on its mid-place price point, which really makes this an affordable rig. Its ruggedly built components, interchangeability, user-afforded option, and extreme portability. For more information on JAG-35's products and accessories, visit JAG35.com. I'm Jonah Gelzo for Audio Tuts Plus and AE Tuts Plus. Thanks for watching and happy filmmaking.